wants to go. Buying Beverly. Great shout out for buying Beverly Hills. These two with their product placement. Oh my God. They took the Meredith Marks course on product placement. Island Mauricio. Well, one thing is for sure, Miss Morgan Wade, she just had a show in Nashville. She performed her little ditty for a few people. And Kyle was there. She was in the front row taking pictures. And then afterwards, Morgan thanked on her social media. She thanked her friends and her family for coming. She thanked everyone. And she said, P.S., I am not fighting with Kyle Richards. Oh, this Morgan, she just, she just doesn't know how this whole world works. She's like, I got to put this on my social media. Now, what nonsense is this for over here and making a statement that I'm not fighting with my BFF? I mean, yeah, you had to make that statement. So guess we just delete things on Instagram. It's all innocent. We're not doing it for attention. And um, because I clean out my Instagram all the time, sure. Kyle says that is what artists do. Really, Kyle? We have an audience here and I ain't cleaning out no Instagram. So there you go. Morgan says they're fine. Kyle says they're fine. I say I truly, truly, truly don't think I care anymore. I just don't care. I'm bored. I'm bored by Kyle. I'm bored by Mauricio. I'm bored by Morgan Wade. I'm bored by Kim and Croy. I'm just bored. It's too much. I don't care. I don't care. That's what happens. <sighs> bet on Blonde. Hey, we can bet on Blonde, guys. It's coming in March, a two, a two hour. I think it's only one episode, two hours. We show Erica preparing for the big day, fighting with her longtime collaborator, Mikey Minden. Erica, you will not be ready. Well, how dare you be disloyal to me, Mr. Minden, even though you probably worked for free for two years when I was my assets were frozen. I had no money. I had to wait for the Beverly Hills check to clear. Erica makes a good salary, but girl, that she has to pay a lot of people. And listen, I actually believe, well, let me just tell you here as I sip my coffee. You hear about that Gorga, Melissa Gorgasita, Messi G. You hear about that Messi G and Josefina Gorgasita. Apparently they don't pay people. That's what you hear. I don't know if it's true. And you hear about so many of these housewives not paying people. I would venture to say that Erica, who doesn't have a ton of money, she makes a good salary, don't get me wrong, but you got to factor in the glam and now flying glam and all this other stuff. She has a lot of expenses, but I'm not crying a river for Erica Jane, don't get me wrong, but I just think that for all you hear about Messi G and Josefina Gogacita and all the housewives that you hear don't pay their bills and you're like, yeah. Duh, of course this person doesn't want to pay for anything. This doesn't shock me. I bet you I'm going to put my money on Vegas. Bet I'm, I'm going to bet on the blonde, okay? I guarantee you Erica pays. Like, I can just see it. She's not one. She's very serious. She's like, <laughs> look, that's how fucking Tom got in trouble. I bet you she takes care of the assistant and Mikey and the glam. And I don't think Erica is... Look, we all want something for free. You know, she's in the public eye. I'm sure she gets plenty of things for free. But I can tell you, I bet you Erica is not a scumbag stiffing the people that have. She has a loyal team. She's, uh, speaking of loyal teams, I don't know how, but the Marge. I mean, the Marge has Lexi and she has people loyal to her. So, I mean, look, I've seen Marge. She treats her people well. She does. But, you know. Bet on Blanche. She, she treats her people well, Bet Erica. Stasi, 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 Stasi did that interview a few weeks ago saying, you know, she just said, well, they're not going to be on Valley, Valley Village because, you know, she's not friends with these people. Like, pains me that her, that she just, you know, her and Brittany just did an interview saying, look, if Stasi and I ran into each other, we have all these mutual friends, Sheena and Lala, we're great, we hug, but we're just not friends. 
it's sad, but that happens. Brittany also said that the thing that makes her the most nervous about Valley Village is Cruz. Cruz. She does not want someone coming for a two-year-old. Well, I mean, that's not too much to ask. Leave Cruz alone, guys. Go after Daddy Jax. Come on. Valley Village, again. I Listen, I hope it's good. I'm not a nasty person. I want to love it all. I want to love it all. I want to love it all as much as I love selling Sunset. You know what I mean? So I hope Valley Village is good. I, I really do. It's just, I'm not... <sighs> I'm not so sure, you guys. I'm not so sure. Let's talk about, let me tell you something. This fucking Alexis, I mean, she also knows what she's doing, but she also doesn't give a fuck. I mean, these two are just made for each other. I mean, look, she knows what she's doing, but I love someone who just doesn't give a fuck. Alexis might have some jersey in her after all. I mean, I, I really have to say, as far as my most underrated housewives. I'm going to have to put Alexis Bellino on that list. Oh my God. I'm going to put Alexis Bellino on that list. She just posted a literally like five hours ago, which will now be like three days. What day is it today? Thursday? It'll be two days. She posted 48 hours ago. The math is mathing here today, people. A picture of her and John Jansen laying on a couch with two dogs. One is his, I believe. And I believe one is hers. And she posts the following. Sorry, I was just getting it. She said, so it's her, John, laying on a couch on her Instagram. And there are two dogs. And she added music. And the song is called, I Love You Always Forever. Oh, yeah. We know that song. She says, this pic says it all. Don't worry, Johnny. Now, right there, I'm, like, going to puke. She calls him Johnny, Johnny Jansen. Okay, this pick says it all. Don't worry. Johnny and I are equal opportunists using each other for this one pick. Just missing six kids, four more dogs, 25 fish, five reptiles to complete this photo. Photo credit. One of our six kids. Comment below which kiddo snapped this pic. Oops, the comments are off. Smiley face. Where do we begin with this? Where do we begin? Um, yeah, I don't like that you call him Johnny. Uh, you're equal opportunists using each other for this one pic. Well, okay, sure, we all agree. And... I mean, Jesus Christ, forget the six kids for a minute. Four dogs, 25 fish, five reptiles. Oh my God. And then you people want to know why I say, Sarah, you hear her trying to fix me up. Patty Stanger is now fixing me up. Calls out of nowhere. I have a guy for you. Everyone then wants to know why I'm like, I'm good. I'm good. Um, I mean, fix me up, Patty, but I'm good. Everyone can fix me up, but 